A Vermont State Police trooper is in critical condition after a nasty crash that shut down Interstate 89 for hours this morning. It happened just north of the Bethel exit, which is exit 3 on 89 North. NBC5's John Hawks has been following the situation all day and has the very latest for us right now. John? Yeah, hi Jack, that's right. I'm in Royalton at the State Police Barracks where officials are still trying to figure out what led to a trooper-related co serious collision earlier today on Interstate 89. Vermont State Police tell us around 8.30 a.m. a trooper was responding to an accident on Interstate 89 in the northbound lanes just north of the Bethel exit, exit 3, near mile marker 23. That's when they say a cruiser hit a parked fire truck that was stopped on the highway already on the scene, responding to an overturned box truck just a little further north. The cruiser smashed into the guardrail, resulting in significant damage to the car. The Vermont State Trooper's name has not yet been released. But that's when but we were told that he's in critical condition and has been airlifted to Dartmouth Hitchcock Medical Center in Lebanon earlier this morning. The section of the interstate where the crash happened was closed for hours as authorities used drones and high-tech equipment to try to better understand what happened. Crews have the, have the scene cleared now, and northbound tra traffic is continuing to flow. And we're st here at the barracks trying to find out some new information. But for now, live in Royalton, John Hawks, NBC5 News.